Great Cortex allows you to quickly and accurately view communications between various parts of your network and the outside world. We give you an easy to read graphical representation of communications based on the filters you choose. Let's see some examples of where this is useful. The first is network dependency. Let's say you're going to move a server's physical location. You don't have an idea yet of what clients are sending backups to the server. You need to develop a dependency map. Here's an example of that map. We filtered by the backup server's name and we're looking for internal traffic. Now we can see who's communicating with that server. In this case, thicker lines indicate more communication. In the second example, let's say you want to know who's violating internal policies. In this case, who in the finance department has been accessing Facebook at work? Here, we can see not only all of the IPs that have been accessing Facebook, but also this thicker line indicates that one IP has been accessing Facebook a lot. If you hover on it, you can see all the Facebook applications that are involved. Finally, you suspect that a host has become infected. So you filter by its IP address and you can see a visualization of all the IPs that the host has been communicating with. We see that all of them are blacklisted because like other visualizations in Mendel, blacklisted IPs are also shown here as orange. This tells you that it's highly likely that your host is infected. To the right, we can see all of the subnets where those IP addresses are located. And again, thicker lines indicate more communication. To find out more about how Gray Cortex can help you quickly view interactions within your network, contact your local distributor or Gray Cortex directly.